Well, five Trimbegonia nationals will leave our shores next Tuesday to head over to Cuba as they earn the highly anticipated medical scholarships awarded by the country. In the signing ceremony in Port of Spain on Friday, Education Minister Anthony Garcia said the opportunity represents not only a chance at improving this country's health sector, but also enforces the need for bilateral relationships throughout the region. Parents and well-wishers could not hide the pride on their faces on Friday morning as they gathered to celebrate the achievements of their loved ones. Years of hard work and dedication finally paid off. One postgraduate student and four undergraduates are set to embark on a new journey in their tertiary level education as the Cuban government for another year fulfilled their commitment to Trinbegonia Nationals by offering five medical scholarships. Minister of Education Anthony Garcia expressed gratitude to Cuba, adding that he's confident the students were in good hands. Every opportunity that is given to our young people to improve themselves academically must be embraced. And what I am sure of, if, I, if only I'm to judge from past experiences, is that the scholarships offerings that have been made by the people and the Republic of Cuba, those scholarships are of very high standards. Mr. Garcia said the partnership is only one example of how important it is to foster good bilateral relations. He said both countries have maintained a decent relationship for quite some time. And that relationship spans more than a period of 46 years, I am told. And during that time, our citizens and citizens of Cuba have been moving to and fro across the both territories. One of the scholarship awardees from 2015, Pearl Charles, recalled her first year in Cuba, saying she was grateful for the care the lecturers devoted to their students. She said it definitely made being away from home easier. Um, you, you tend to, to gravitate more um, to studying and to putting out your best foot forward because you not only want to make yourself proud, the country proud, but you want to make your lecturers pr proud as well. well. That's something Shanice Simmons said brings great comfort to her as she prepares to begin the program. She recalled the excitement on being confirmed as one of the awardees. At first, pure excitement, a bit of shock and a bit of trepidation because I was like, wow, I really have to start, well, continue brushing up on my Spanish. So that was the first thing, actually. Cuba recently introduced scholarship opportunities to study stomatology, a branch of medicine which focuses on the mouth and nearby structures. Mr. Garcia urged students to take advantage of this. As he said, it will potentially improve dental care in Trinidad and Tobago. Liren Brummel, C News. <laughs>